Hello and welcome to Sunday School Online. Today we're going to learn about the fruits of the spirits. Today we're going to look at kindness. Now I'm going to read scripture, Ephesians 4, verse 32, and I shall read. It says, And be kind to one another, tender hearted, forgiving one another, even as God in Christ forgave you. What is kindness? Kindness is, it's being nice to people, it's being friendly, it's being forgiving, it's being, um, what can I say, treating people like how you want to be treated. What do I mean by that? Um, if I'm going out to play and I said, come on, let's all join in and play this game. That is being kind because you're inviting other people to play with you. But if I one day go out and says, I don't want you to play with me. I don't want you to play with me. That's not being nice, that's being very nasty. You need to be kind and show loving and kindness to other people. Make sure everybody is friendly, everybody wants to be your friend, everybody wants to play with you at school. Not everybody, but most people would want to play because, you know, when you've got kindness in your heart, it shines, it shines through. So that is what kindness is to me, is to be loving and kind to everybody. It's not easy to be kind because we live in a world that's really, really selfish about me and what I want and what I'm going to do. But God doesn't like that at all. You have to show love and kindness these are all fruits of the spirit all these things are very hard to do it's easy to to be bad but it's harder to be a nice person so we must show people our kindness and our goodness just like jesus did right now we're gonna draw right we're gonna Get our little paper and we're going to cut out one of these circles. Get a grown up to do that. Yes, what are we going to write on here? Kindness. And at the back, what we're going to do, what does kindness mean to you? Could be anything. Just tell me what kindness means to you. So, what do we need? Our, that's correct, our colouring pencils. And we our little circle. Remember, the song's going to come on, so you're going to draw and sing. And what we're going to write on here? Kindness. And what we're going to write at the back? What does kindness mean to you? So what does it mean to you? Have you thought about it? Ready, steady, go.
guys so it's that time again to draw so so far we have done love we've done joy we've done patience and peace but this week we are working on what did Beth say again she said kindness so get your circle and we're gonna write kindness that starts with the K I N D N E S and another S When I think of kindness, I think of someone giving me a present and me saying, that's kind of you. They were kind enough to give me a gift. So I'm going to draw a present on here. With a little bow on top. draw a pineapple right here and maybe another fruit I'm thinking of drawing an avocado what do you think now let's color that in What did Bev teach us about kindness? Well, I like to be kind to other people, and I love people to be kind to me. So, I'm gonna write, treat others as you would like to be treated. And there we have it. We have kindness. Let's put it with the rest of them. Well done, guys. We've done five fruits of the spirit. Now let's get back to the song. How did we do? This is mine. Kindness. Did you write on the other side? What does kindness mean to you? Kindness means to me loving, forgiving, friendly. Any of those things will do. 
and don't forget to write the big word to go on your beautiful necklace. We're nearly getting there. We've got kindness, joy, patience, peace and love. And the big one, fruit of the spirit. So that one goes down here and the rest of them go here. Oh, our necklace is coming along very nicely, isn't it? Can't wait to show you the end results. Now, don't forget to send your pictures in the email below and I'll have a look at it. Bye. Till next week. Bye.